should still have it. I think the newest just has a full Thunderbolt port. All right, I'll, I don't know, I have to look at that. I don't. It's been a while since I had to buy a new computer. Open up, got him, that's a mismatch. might have a 2014.
correct me if I'm wrong, the chip, when you upload it to the Mac, isn't that like a large file? Yeah, it's so but crystal clear. It is, but it's a large file because it's uh, you ran it for 40 minutes at a time. So these files, right. you ran them for 40 minutes. Um, I mean, you're talking like I mean, you get high level quality films. You do, but you're talking like 20, 30 minute get, uh, 20, 30 gig file. It's big. It's big. It's big. And then if you do 4K, it's even bigger. But I don't see a reason if that's what you're doing, just exchanging uh, files. Right. And that's gonna that's gonna slow your computer down. And the yeah. import process is probably a higher uh, one, right. Importing it. I'm importing sure. it. No, actually, it's not that long. They're quicker nowadays, right? Yeah, they got so much faster. It's the. Um, it's not the import, it's the actual... I just think what I have to do is, after I import it and upload to that website, yeah. probably drag it onto an external drive because it's just taking up so much space. Yeah, that's computer. what I would do. Just get an external hard drive, just label it as, it's this game, it's this game, it's this game, it's this game. This way you know. Right, right. Awesome. And then you could also just say, that's like this whole season, archive, done, next year, archive, done. This way you can always go back if you had to. That's a K-Box. Lacey. Yeah, Lacey's a guy. Lacey's nice. The problem with those is, if you keep them in your store a couple seasons on the games, they could go to put Oh yeah. in a second, and bam, you lose everything, you know what I mean? What I've been using is um, the, the West, I've been actually going to Best Buy, just get the Western Digitals that are the big fat fucks. What's it called, Western Digital? Western Digital. What are those? Are those a, do they need a power source you gotta plug into? Yeah, you just have a plug source, so they're more stable. Right. And I mean, a four get a four terabyte um, hard drive. It runs like 120 bucks nowadays. That's pretty good. It's really good. And then if you wanted to, you can you could buy two and just have one as a backup, one yeah. as the prime, and I'm that's it. I'm just afraid of buying such a big those, external. I get it because yeah. I feel I, I can't trust those. All right, I understand. You know what I'm saying? Do they ever give out? Are they giving out on you, and you're like, oh shit. I've had one give out, and it was. Um, and it just the computer just doesn't read it. You're plugging it in. Yeah, yeah, the computer just doesn't read it, but it just I have one, but I have I have hard drives from like 10 years ago. The computer reads wow. in a heartbeat. Wow. And they're all Western Digital, so. Western Digital. It's something, they knew how to make it. I gotta write that down, that's the brand name? Yeah. Yeah, if you actually walk into a Best Buy, you could buy four, you could buy a six terabyte, and online you can order an eight terabyte if you really want. One terabyte is how many gigs? So we're talking 4,000 gigs. It's, it's, it's incredible. Okay. Right. And each game you said is about how many gigs? Six it'd be anywhere between, in, in, in a 40 minute like this, Right. it can, based on how big the size is, it can be 20 to 30 gigs a piece. Right. Right. Western, Western Digital. Maybe instead of the Black Magic, I'll just go with the chip. Yeah. And go with my direct HDMI and just get one of those suckers. Yeah. That way I have two back, two copies. Yeah. I could probably still finagle the disc thing somehow. Alright. Western Digital External Drive. Yeah, it's
Stay right here. 